Number 18, a 0.7 kilograms ball moving horizontally at 5 meters per second, strikes a vertical wall and rebounds with a speed 2 meters per second. What is the magnitude of the change in its linear momentum? So the momentum of the ball is equal to its mass times its velocity. And the change in the momentum is equal to mass times delta V. So the magnitude of the change in its linear momentum is equal to mass times the magnitude of delta V. So let's make a, a, a draw over here of what's happening. So we have initially a ball here that is moving towards the wall with an initial speed of 5 meters per second and then it hits the wall and goes into the other direction with a final speed of 2 meters per second. So the point here is that the speeds have opposite signs. For example, if this is positive, this one is negative. So that's the whole story here. So delta momentum is equal to the mass times the final speed minus the initial speed. And this is equal to mass times minus 2 minus 5, right? However, this is in magnitude, so it, we would take the positive sign. So it is m times 7, right? Minus 2 minus 5 minus 7. However, we want the magnitude, so it is plus 7. So the mass of the ball is 0 0.7 kilograms. We have to multiply it by 7 meters per second. And this is equal to 4.5. 9 kilograms meters per second and that's it